Welcome to Projects and Bootstrap 4 by Edgeonix. I'd like to give you an overview of the different projects that we're going to be creating in this course. So to start off with, we're gonna have a photo sharing website. That's gonna have multiple pages and the layouts are gonna be a little bit different as you go from say the home page into some of the other areas. We get into a resume site. It's a really polished off resume site. All these sites, we're gonna see how do you use the Bootstrap 4 grid and create the corresponding layouts with that. And a number of the other tools that are available in Bootstrap 4 as well. And I'm gonna show you these sites real quick. We're gonna do some quick walkthroughs. So you'll see, you'll have a good idea of what's coming inside of the course. We have a social networking website that we're going to create the layout for. So a lot going on in that site. We have an agency site, really clean, professional looking website. And we have a light box site. So it's gonna to be to demonstrate some photos. You can click on one, you'll get the light box when you click on it. All right, so enough with all the talking. Let's go ahead and take a look at each of these sites one by one. Here we have the photo sharing website. So at the top, you can see we have this Jumbotron. As we scroll down, we have an area here to learn more about some different photos in particular. We have titles, a little bit of text below those, a button. As we go down here, we have a feature section. So all of these are being split up into their own columns. So you can see here, we have two columns that have uh, widths that are gonna be different than the three up here, three columns up here. And then we have a footer down here, of course. If you look at the top, this is a sticky menu that we have. We can click on about, go to that page. And then we have as well, you can see these sliders are moving up and down. We've got the contact page, how do you create a form? So all, that's what's coming inside of the photo sharing website, a pretty good exploit of a lot of the different features in Bootstrap 4. All right, and then we have the, the resume website, which is really clean and nice looking. So we'll see how to create this particular layout inside of Bootstrap 4. And moving on, we have as well the social website. You can see quite, quite a bit that's going on in this website. And we have different layouts for these other pages that we're gonna have to deal with also. So scrolling down, you can see the different areas. So we have the main section of content that's taking up close to two thirds of the page column. And then we have another column over here is a sidebar with some additional items inside of it. And then we have a footer at the bottom. All right, and then we move on to the agency website. So I'll just scroll up here to the top. You can see this is really nice looking website. Um, we have a few effects going on in the menus up here. And as I scroll down, you get this jumbotron right here. We scroll down, we have another area here to introduce some of the features that may be offered by the agency. And just scrolling down again, really clean. Some of our clients are listed here. And then at the bottom, we end with the footer. So it's just blocking off these dis different sections in rows and making it interesting because it's dividing them up. You have white, then you have an image, you go back to white. So it keeps you visually entertained. All right, so the next project is going to be the light box. So right here, we have a main photo that we can click and we have scrolling that we can do so we can go between these photos. Down here, we can click a photo and you'll see the light box comes up. And then I can click the X, the light box goes away. We have a sticky menu at the top. And if I click on four column layout, that's a little bit different from what we were seeing earlier. And then we have these tabs. So that is what's gonna go into creating the Lightbox website. And those are the projects that we're going to be covering in the course.